back to my YouTube video. I know it's been close to like a month. I'm sorry. I just, I don't know what to film. And I kind of been struggling to just find a topic to film. But the last time I asked, you guys wanted to see some of the struggles of having my business and what I've kind of need to work on, I guess. So that's what today's video is. Saying like the main struggle is like legal stuff. Like, I don't know. I still don't understand it. But apart from that, finances, like I just... I kind of need to budget myself and figure out when it's a good time to actually make purchases because so the next struggle is getting like exposure and clientele so without having that exposure um it's hard to get sales like to the point where it's benefiting me like buying more stuff so i'll buy more inventory really limited quantities but i'll buy more just because i'm like oh like i would want to sell this like if i was a customer i would want to purchase this because it's so cute like you know but because I don't have that kind of exposure, like I'll buy inventory and then not sell it and then it's just kind of sitting there. So then that impacts me like when it comes to like real life because I'm wasting my money, which is like, I guess you like wouldn't call it wasting because at the end of the day, like it's for my business, but it's also like I'm the one paying for everything like shipping. I know you guys like pay for shipping, but I'll have like discounts. So you know when you get like free shipping, someone has to pay the shipping and that's me or like discounts like I'm taking a hit for that so it's like certain things and then like I don't know so that's like the main things would be like my finances and um exposure like getting more people to see my brand and kind of get to know me and my brand so that's like the hardest thing and then with that also comes um like giveaways like I try doing different things so like if you guys have any suggestions let me don't know <laughs> let me know down below but like I've had some giveaways like at first the giveaways were good and this last giveaway I did I had so many entries but you could see who like the real people are supporting you and then who was just like spam like that are entering your giveaway so because I put like hashtag giveaway a lot of the people that were commenting only followed and commented and liked the picture because they wanted to get free stuff and then like as soon as they didn't win the giveaway they'll like unfollow you like unlike everything so it's kind of like annoying I guess because there's people that are trying to win like trying to engage with you while there's a giveaway going on just to win free stuff but they're not actually supporting you they don't actually care for your brand they just want free stuff and it's hard doing stuff like that because realistically like I wouldn't want somebody that just wants spams your account just to get freebies to get something free as opposed to like somebody that's been supporting me and I don't, I don't mean making purchases like just liking my stuff commenting sharing my posts like stuff like that like I would rather somebody like that win than somebody who's just doing it to get something free out of you so that's kind of like another thing because I I do that to try to get more exposure and kind of get a following but it doing giveaways just gets the wrong customers like I don't want somebody that just wants free stuff like I sometimes send freebies with my orders but that's because I feel like they deserve it like you know and I kind of stop doing that for the same thing that I'm wasting so much money so because of that I'm not doing no more freebies um I don't know if in the future I will but I feel like I'm just losing money because I don't know I don't know I feel like it's, it's a, the people pleaser in me like I want to give freebies and all that and it's like it's nice when you order from a company and they give you something for free like it's it's just like the thought of it but it's also hurting me financially. So that's kind of where I'm struggling at, like financially and what I really want to do. Like realistically, I would want, I mean, not realistically, theoretically, I guess. I would want like nice packaging, like box packaging with my logo and stuff, but all of that adds up. So I don't want to kind of waste money on that when I'm not even getting sales, you know? Like right now, I think my main focus is just getting exposure for my brand and getting a bigger clientele. So that's kind of what I'm working towards now. But I am struggling to figure that out because like I said, giveaways, like they don't work. I've tried TikTok. I I don't know, like I think TikTok just attracts other businesses and then you guys just kind of support each other, but it doesn't attract customers. And like, I don't know, it's nice, but TikTok just hasn't been working for me either. Other than that, I really don't know what else to do. So if you guys have any tips, like let me know because I've seen some companies like or brands um, comment on people's posts like oh like check out my jewelry page 
and like it's cool but i also feel like i don't know i wouldn't want somebody like to comment on my page trying to get themselves customers like does that make sense like kind of using like your following to gain for themselves so i wouldn't want to get on somebody's page and just be like hey like by the way follow me like you know or like in youtube videos when they do that like youtube comments so yeah i don't know what to do that's my struggle so if you guys have any like questions or not questions what questions do but if you guys have any like i guess recommendations of what i should do let me know um and yeah that's pretty much like the main struggles with it other than that it's just kind of taking product pictures and i think if i were to be able to take better quality product pictures it would make my feed look better aesthetically pleasing and would attract more customers because honestly for me when i'm shopping i look at like how their instagram is like how their product looks how their product pictures look like the better the quality the better like chances of me purchasing from it because i'm like oh, okay i could clearly see what this is and i struggle with taking like nice pictures of my products because it's from my iphone like i don't have a nice quality camera i'm not going to be able to afford to purchase a nice camera quality so i just use my phone and it works like for some things but like for rings like i don't know how to take pictures of rings like that's probably the hardest one and then on top of that getting like sizes for everyone like kind of being able to please everyone when it comes to sizes is so hard because like it goes back to me like not wanting to spend a lot like having very limited quantity but then also like i want limited quantity because i know i'm not gonna sell everything but then everyone wants more sizes so it's it's just kind of a struggle and then i get more sizes but nobody purchases it so it's just kind of like i guess figuring it out and i mean it's only been a year so it's okay like you live and you learn so i'm kind of learning to adjust trying new things um so hopefully like in the next year everything will get better i'm obviously going to continue it because the good overdo the overdoes the bad like there's so much more good to it like i enjoy what i do i enjoy shopping for it i enjoy packaging orders i enjoy talking to customers like i enjoy everything about it like especially the support like i'm so thankful for the support and it's it's been a good year honestly like that's just like the bad is like pretty minor compared to how good everything has been so i know in the future everything will work out and i'm going to keep it going like i'm not going to stop so yeah, hopefully you guys are there to continue supporting me in the near future. Not the near future. It's already here. My website is up if you guys want to go look at it. But yeah, hopefully you guys continue to support me and my business and we'll kind of get through this together. But yeah, thank you guys for being so supportive and please remember to like and share this video. Bye!